Oh, hi, Tessa. We were just meaning to come talk to you. Hi, Tessa. Long time no see. My god, you look like a completely different person. It's me. Plus beard. Yes. So we were out at the old house today. Heavens, why would you go there? Surprised it's even still standing. We found some stuff in Mary Ann's room that took us by surprise. Oh, really? We want to ask you some questions about her. You're the only person who might have known Mary Ann better than us. I, I don't know about that. It's been a decade, kids. I know, but I need to ask. What is it? Did she ever talk about me being a boy? No. It never came up. I found out much later, just like everybody else. Marianne was obviously concerned. She really didn't confide in you at all? Your mother was intensely private. She didn't need anyone else, and she made that clear. But this was about Tyler. She was always willing to ask for help when it came to us. Not at the end. Look, I have a lot on my plate today. I'm sorry. My advice to you would be to try to move on. It's not that easy. <sighs> what happened that night? You can't understand something like that, but it was God's plan. That's all we can know. I need to go now. Best of luck to you, truly. What the hell was that? I told you she wouldn't talk. It's like she's got CIA training. Something's weird here. It's weird, right? Yeah, I feel it too. It's like something's on the tip of my tongue. You all done yet? Yeah, Mom. Can we go outside while you and Tessa play cards? I'm afraid there's no time for games today, sweetie. Now let's go. Marianne, can you come here? Sorry, Tessa, I'm in a bit of a hurry. Oh? What's your excuse this time? Emergency repairs for the beaver dam? Tessa, look. No, I don't want to hear it. I want to talk to you now. Or do I need to start calling in your debts? I'd completely forgotten about that. I remember it, but not exactly Is like it? that. Here, let's see if we can call up my version, okay? <laughs> oh. Oh, my version up. Uh, Mom, can we go outside while you and Tessa play cards? No, there's no time for games today. Marianne, can we talk? No, we can't. Just leave the groceries, kids. Let's go. Don't. Please, let's just talk for a few minutes. Okay? Okay. I guess that makes sense. Rashomon, you know? But whatever happened, after that, they walked to the counter, and then Marianne lashed out at Tess. Please, right? let's just talk for a few minutes. Marianne, okay? Please, Marianne, I'm just trying. Stay away from my children. They don't need your guidance. I'm just trying to help. I don't need help. Not from you, not from anyone else in this fucking town. I'm done with all of you. You're done with the food I give you? The fuel? Maybe you are, but the kids are my children, Tessa. Mine, not yours. Please, let's not do this here. Let's go into my office. Fine. Okay. You two, wait here. What is wrong with you? Hmm. I'm so skeptical. <clears throat> okay. For now, let's say Marianne was being Marianne. But once they got into the office, they both went at it. Hard. 
What do you think they were arguing about? Me? Don't know. It was impossible to hear anything after she cranked up the music. But hey, now that we know she was lying to our faces, let's ask her. Hey, Alte. Is there something I can do for you? Earlier you said Marianne kept everything to herself. But you two had a big fight a few months before her death, didn't you? We argued all the time. You'll have to be more specific. This wasn't about who cheated at Canasta. This was intense. You locked yourselves in the office so we couldn't hear. I'm sorry. It was a long time ago. Now, I was in the middle of something. Okay. We'll leave you to it. Damn it. I think she knows more than she's letting on. <sighs> uh, duh. But there's no way to nail her down when we don't even know what we mean. If we could pinpoint what it was about, she'd be out of excuses. Sure, but how do we do that? The music was too loud to make out what they were saying. Mm. Marianne and Tessa were obsessed with that song. It was on all the time. What are you thinking? We've been getting these visions whenever we see or hear something really emotional. Maybe listening to it will trigger something. Hmm. You may be onto something here, Ronan. We can't go back to her with anything half-assed. We should go talk to Tom. Make sure we build as strong of a case as possible. Okay. Let's see if we can figure out what song it was. Hmm. We should go talk to Tom, right? Let's see if he can make a song. Tom war there, no? Hey, Tom. There's something I can help you with? This might be a weird question, but... Do you remember the song that Tessa and Marianne used to love? They played it all the time? <laughs> How could I forget? Uh, I think she's still got the CD back here. A little worse for the wear, of course. Uh, hold on. Uh, here it is. I was happy when it got put away, to be honest. A bit cheesy for my tastes. Is it right? Think so. <laughs> Whoa, I just got hit with a flood of memories. You seeing what I'm seeing? Yeah. song no oh, i couldn't possibly some of us are actually trying to get work done here i forgot how carefree she could be yeah what the hell happened Kids keep pestering me for these candies. They're so expensive. I'll just grab a bag. It's fine. Oh, no. I, I can't, Tessa. It's nothing. Okay. But write it down in your little notebook. Okay, okay. Whatever you want. There. Happy? Yes. And I'll be by on Wednesday to help you close. Like I promised. I think you mean Tessa was self-righteous and treated Marianne like a charity case. She was trying to help. We should see if we can find that notebook she was holding. I know Tessa still keeps a bunch of them in here somewhere. 
What are you doing here? Uh, I thought you needed help in the store. I needed help two hours ago. Have you been drinking? What? No, I just had a day, okay? I took a pill. I'm fine. There he is. I said I'm fine. Kids, come on, let's go. Wait, please. I have something for you. Take a look at this when you get home, okay? They can handle this confusion. I've been working with these people for years. They can help. What do you think that pamphlet was Tessa gave to Marianne? I don't know. I saw it in Marianne's room. It had a creepy vibe, but I didn't think much about it. It was bad, though. Maybe conversion therapy bad. I'm sorry. This is true. I want to know how Marianne felt about it. We need to hit Tessa with some hard proof. Shouldn't we try to find something about the pamphlet Tessa gave Marianne? Good idea. What was the organization called? The Alliance Against Other People's Business? Shouldn't we try to find something about the pamphlet Tessa gave Marianne? Good idea. <coughs> what was the organization called? The Alliance Against Other People's Business? Uh, Tessa? Is it okay if I run a quick Google search? My phone's dead. Sure, but make it quick. I'm going to need the computer. Virtue Seekers Youth Camp. Is that what she recommended for Tyler? I don't know what to say. I'm sorry, Tyler. Yeah. Let's see how Tessa explains this one away. Tag mit Dr. Whitemore ansehen. Gottes Plan für die Sexualität. In christlich Tate voller Kraft, die dein Leben verändern werden. <lacht> Leitfaden für Eltern zur Vorbeugung von Homosexualität. Kämpfe für Tugendstrebende seit 20 Jahren, jetzt Aufnahme für 2015. Hm. <lacht> ja. Ah, was ist das hier? <lacht> ich bin gerade von meinem Arbeitsurlaub zurückgekommen. Geht schon lange klar. Nein, das. Aus. Ah. Here's a here's a newsletter from the Alliance for Traditional Families. Wow. Yikes. Ja, die ist ein bisschen angewidert. <lacht> Can I help you, Allison? Oh, no, no thanks. I'm good. I'm just looking for something that I forgot. Ah, 2004. Anything interesting? Juni, 24 Dollar für Essen. Also September, 11 Dollar Puppe für die Kleine. Eric A. Okay. Vor 50 Dollar abbezahlt, Februar Schulden. Prinzipfall abbezahlt. Oh, Marianne. No show. It looks like Marianne started making her <coughs> debt in October 2004. Five months before her. That night. I think we've seen enough. Yeah, we've got a good sense of what went down. Let's talk to Tessa. 50 Dollar für Benzin abbezahlt, Einkäufe 30, neue Jacke für Allison abbezahlt, im Laden geholfen, für Medikamente abbezahlt, August Einkäufe abbezahlt, in Hauptzeit ausgeholfen, Inventur, 140 Dollar für Waschmaschinenreparatur, nicht gekommen. Was nicht gekommen? Okay. Wir haben neue Schuhe für die Kinder, Check geplatzt. September nicht gekommen, kein Rückruf, Januar nicht gekommen. What's 
this doing here? Am Gegenstand. <lacht> Oder? Okay, Tessa. Is there something I can do for you? We're back with details that should help your memory. Oh, really? Yes, really. Marianne was having one of her days. You were trying to talk, but she wasn't cooperating. The two of you started arguing, and you went in the office and cranked up that song you both loved. Hmm. And when was that? Well, our memories don't exactly have timestamps. Uh. Wann war das? Fuck. <lacht> Over, ne, oder? October 2004. That was when she stopped trying to pay her debts, right? Yes. I don't know why she always found a way to pay before that. But we never argued about money. I, I was frustrated, but you can't squeeze blood from a stone. Yeah, we didn't think you guys were arguing about money. Hmm. We know you support the Alliance for Traditional Families, and that you gave her the pamphlet about their camp. What camp? The Virtue Seekers Youth Camp. It was conversion therapy. You told her that Tyler should go there. I, uh, um, I... D Look, your mother was in a bad place. It was clear Suck. she was coming apart at the seams. She told me she'd been struggling with you, and I'd heard such good things about that camp. Your answer to my mother's bad moods was to send me to conversion therapy? It's what I thought would help. Both of you, at the time. Tyler, it was worse than bad moods. She was not well. Not well at all. Do you know what they do to kids in those places? I do. Now. And how did Marianne take your helpful suggestion? Badly. She wanted to let you be whatever perfect little butterfly was in that cocoon. And yes, we argued about it. So she was cool with who I was? She was more than that. She loved you. Listen, I don't mean to be rude, but I really <coughs> don't have a lot on my plate today. Okay. We'll get out of your way then. Thanks, Tessa. Das ist jetzt natürlich poor. Okay. Can we grab our groceries? Ah, uh, um, Michael already put them in your trunk. Okay, thanks. Bye, Tom. See you later. What are you thinking? Just, uh, trying to wrap my brain around all that. I can't believe you got Tessa Vecchi to talk about the past. Bravo. Yeah. And Marianne, she had my back. It really doesn't change much, right? She was still fucking crazy. She still tried to kill me. Mm. But knowing she was trying to protect me before whatever the hell happened that pushed her over the edge, it, it feels good, Allison. Hey, look at me. You are allowed to feel however you're feeling about this. God, I could use a smoke. <sighs> you're speaking my language. What? Sorry, I'm just thinking about what this means. Yeah, me too. Well, it's a good thing Eddie's expecting us. He knew Marianne pretty well, and he was in charge of her case. 
Did he ever mention anything about the investigation to you? No, I never asked. And I'm sure he thought I was better off not knowing. Guess that might have made for some awkward dinner conversation. Exactly. But I mean, he's a good cop. Thorough. I'm sure he's got something. Let's go. Like is the color 